Tom Daschle won't fight to serve in President Obama's cabinet. Dogged by questions over tax issues and potential conflicts of interest, the former senator withdrew his nomination for Health and Human Services Secretary. In a statement, Daschle said he would not have been serving with the full faith of the American people and did not want to be a distraction to the president's agenda. Last night, Daschle's nomination was still on track and he said he was sorry for failing to pay $120,000 in back taxes. It was completely inadvertent burden. But that's no excuse. And I deeply apologize. The president said he accepted his close friend's resignation with sadness and regret. Just yesterday, he was asked whether he stood by his choice to lead major reform of the U.S. health care system. Absolutely. Tax problems have weighed on other Obama nominees. Nancy Killifer, picked to be the government's first chief performance officer, also withdrew her name today because she bungled payroll taxes for household help. I think they both recognize that you can't set an example of responsibility, uh, but accept a different standard in who serves. And Treasury Secretary Timothy Geithner had a rockier-than-expected confirmation because he didn't pay thousands of dollars in self-employment taxes. President Obama promised to run a more ethical and accountable administration, but the controversy over some nominees may have put some tarnish on that pledge. Karen Brown, CBS News.